Ms. Luther. The subject's here. He's early. Well, he's eager to get started. He's a real nice guy. He's got nice green eyes like yours. Eve, doing experiments of this nature on a human subject is extremely serious. I've had qualms about even proceeding. You are not making this any easier. I'm so sorry. Of course, you have to proceed. My cousin's in hospice. Metastasized cancer. She's got two little girls. You'd give those kids their mother back. And just imagine all the other families that you'd rescue. Not to mention saving our country. If you level the playing field and make humans super, you could be preventing another civil war. Have you prepared the subject? Yes. His name... No. No, don't tell me his name. We'll refer to him as Subject 0331. Well, you must be the lab tech. I'm your rat. Name's Subject 0331, male, brown hair, green eyes, approximately five foot nine. <clears throat> Three inch scar on the left rear flank. Hockey injury. Buffalo boys can't trust us on the ice. I assume you've read and considered the conditions of the experiment before you sign the contract. Feel free to look it over, but I will need your thumbprint to make it binding. Yeah, wait, by conditions, you mean this part, right? I, the subject, understand and acknowledge the full range of risks, including but not limited to a 15% chance of expiration. Expiration isn't death, right, lab tech? That makes me sound like a carton of milk. If you're uncomfortable with the terms, you can just get dressed and leave. No, no, no. I'm just messing with you. I, of course, I understand the term. It's just, you know, why the soft pedaling? I mean, it's kind of like when everyone would say, I'm so sorry your brother passed. Passed what? Gas? Passed his driver's test? No, he didn't pass, lady. He freaking died. Dead. As in a doornail. Anyways, I digress. It's a thing I do. I'm totally in. Here is my thumbprint. May I see your arm, please? I suggest my left. The ad for this gig made a pretty big deal of the secrecy of the whole thing. But uh, seeing as how I'm putting my life on the line, well, I'd love to know what it's for. Well, you must know the scientist pretty well, right? Can you tell me what he's up to? It's the advancement of science. You're tough. But under all that ice, there's a heart. I can tell. So will I ever get to meet the man behind all this? You have met him. I'm the scientist. 